Holy shit, I'm actually nervous about taking this video. It's been so many months since I, uh, uh, I've done one, so I'm probably a little less scatty than usual, but uh, I just thought I'd say hello. Uh, I'm back for another video on a particular substance that I tried last summer. I know it was a while ago, but I've not really been doing much experimenting. I've done a fair amount of abuse. Uh, I could tell you what I've been up to. Uh, mate, sometimes I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> One. Uh, motherfucking bitch as hell. Um, it is everything. Like, the fucking hype. Everything. It's literally... It is exactly like LSD. I mean, some some people are going to be like, No, actually. No, it's not. Make me feel really. And I'll be like, Oh, fucking shut your mouth. You don't even know what you're talking about, because, yeah. Sh sh just shut your mouth. Just, 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 just shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. LSD. 1P LSD. Basically the same thing. I'm going to have a little caption. All the right, that's the molecular structure for normal LSD. And then... That's the one for... 1P LSD. So as you can see by the two things, if you want to pause my video, do whatever, you can see the two molecular structures are fucking ridiculously similar. You just got a little extra fucking piece of shit down at the bottom. I'm not going to go into more details. Anyway, I tried it once. I think I did one half or two tabs of it. Probably the ideal amount. If you're a newbie and you just fucking just want to try it because it's legal, do one. If you're advanced, do two. If you're a fucking idiot, do 500. It's up to you. You're not going to die. Your brain might, though. <laughs> so I'd be careful with that shit. I'd be fucking careful with that. Uh, um, yeah, on the whole, yeah, it's, 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 the visuals are immaculate. Very clean. Very, it's very, it's got that very acid-esque shape to it when it's i mean it's so strange man like some of the psychedelics i've taken they're very like blurry like 2cb example i love 2cb don't get me wrong i don't want to fucking take the piss but it's very like uh shapey shapey like fun wavy but lsd is is a lot more i don't know it just fucking hits the soul man it's it's so like the way the patterns emerge and fall and the way it develops itself is just so much more it's, it's, it's really hard to explain obviously as everyone tries to explain something which is entirely impossible to explain but we'll still try won't we governor um yeah so I would strongly advise anyone in the UK, uh, parts of Europe, stock up. UK especially, I'm sorry, I'm going to just direct it at you guys for the moment. You need to purchase as as much as you possibly can. It will be barred in the next couple of months when the ban comes of all psychedelic substances. The blanket ban, which I'm sure you've all heard of. Um, you need to fucking make sure you're buying like fucking... As much liquid, 1P LSD, or as much tabs. Fucking just buy as much as you can. Seriously, you can store it well. You can go on Google, find how to store it, find how to fucking do everything you want to do with it. That's all well and good. Um, yeah, just, I mean, be safe. Look after yourselves, obviously, when you're taking it. Again, it's very clean. It's, I wouldn't, it's, because it's not LSD, I can't say that it's entirely safe because it's still a new substance but I me personally and uh, you'll read a lot of other things you, you'll see that it is actually pretty much on par with LSD some people say it's better I personally find it better cleaner um, the the um, the the visuals for me were very intense but they had this like soft like kindness towards them there wasn't a they were like so I've had some LSD where I'm literally bombarded with intense, intricate patterns, and these things are just going, 
I I'm trying to process this. And my little brain can't handle shit, nigga. Did I just say the N word? I might bleep that out, but I'm not sure how to edit a nigga word. I've said it twice now. Right. <laughs> I forgive you, my son. But my Tommy gun don't. <laughs> Let's go again. A bit more so. Genuine. Count. Collective. One. <laughs> fucking doing um yeah so one at the lsd hype check it out fucking brilliant i'd fucking go there again i'm gonna actually i'll tell you now in the next couple of weeks i'm probably gonna buy a large amount of it i'm gonna store it probably at a friend's house um i can store it at my house i guess um put it in my freezer but i just don't want like anyone waking up and like swallowing fucking 500 tabs of like acid which has been like wedged between two pieces of bacon just wouldn't be a good thing like it just would it would be fucking <laughs> <laughs> um <laughs> uh, trip usually lasts roughly from five to ten hours in between there the come down on one plsd wasn't actually too bad i'm not gonna lie it was it was pretty chill it was pretty chill like i actually i so i finished my night shift in the morning and after that I fucking i what did, what did i do after that yeah so i finished at about 7 30 in the morning I think I smoked a load of salvia in a field with a friend. Don't even ask me why I'm doing that. But I did it and it was just pretty cool. Like the sun was out. It was lovely. It was a fucking beautiful day. Bang, bang, bang. Shing, shing, shing. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Do you like my t-shirt, by the way? It's fucking fat, in it? Yeah. Look all these. They're all like fucking weird wrestler people. Yeah, fucking look a bit of that, you little fucking chipmunk. Um... Ah, uh, yeah, so uh, I did the salvia, and what else did I do? Yeah, I fucking, um, yeah, so I dropped the salvia, and then I dropped half a tab, and I think I dropped another tab when I got here. I didn't have any weed, I just went to my room, and by the time I cycled home, it already kicked in. So the visuals in my room were, like, pretty, obviously it was the morning, I'm just, like, fucking tripping my mind off at, like, probably, like, by 8, 30, 9 o'clock, I was, like, Mm, it was lush and then I got really productive and then I went to go see a girl later that evening um, Because I was coming off the end of an LSD trip um, I don't think I even slept like what I did was I fucking like tripped and then afterwards I like came down off it and with psychedelics and acids especially I don't really get a come down I don't get a come up. I don't get a come down. I, I'm, I've got a, quite a, le a, a level playing field all the way through a bit up and down, obviously, naturally, we're all human. Uh, and then, towards the end, it was just like, oh, okay, I have a cigarette. Shouldn't have done that, but I like cigarettes, so I did. Uh, and I was outside, I had a cigarette in the sun. I was like, that's fucking beautiful. I really enjoyed that trip, and I felt so good. I was like, you know what, I feel like, I feel really productive right now. Uh, like, literally, on the end of the trip, like, I'd stopped tripping, but I still had that, like, this, this mild buzz. Uh, it was a really beautiful mild buzz. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Anyway, so I had decided to clean the kitchen, and I hoovered, and then I entirely cleaned my room. My room was pretty fucked up, to be honest. It was pretty bad. And I cleaned all that up, and I was like, yeah, man, this is good. So I fucking walk, went out for a walk, and I did a tiny bit of meditating in a field, just mindfulness, really. Just Well, actually mindlessness i suppose it was actually just um uh silent meditation i wasn't actually trying to achieve anything it's because i'd i'd been through such a large trip i just thought you know what go into a matter field in the middle of nowhere undisrupted just sit cross legs and i thought i'd play music not too sure um doesn't really matter and i was just sat there i was like yeah uh, this is yeah it, it, i don't know it was just so tranquil uh, eventually I opened my eyes afterwards and I usually just like naturally trip on trees like I love intense staring it's just one of those things I'm really good at don't judge me for it but I stare at literally everything fucking even people people are just like have you got a fucking problem have you got a fucking problem mate I'm like no I don't I'm just fucking oh you got beautiful eyes I fucking love you <laughs> and um yeah, so, yeah, um, that was sort of the end of my trip. And then basically, because I had to go see a girl later that evening, I came back to my house. Shh. 
shut up, you. I had to go back to my house. I met my dad. My dad like looked at me really nudged me. I was like, oh fuck, does he know that I'm just a fuckhead? And I was like, you alright, mate? How you doing? And he was like, I was like, okay, I'm just gonna fucking eat this food and get out of the kitchen as quickly as possible. <laughs> like, fuck this guy. I, I swear he knew, like, he was probably thinking, like, fucking, what, what's he doing fucking being like this somewhere? <laughs> <laughs> this is probably just my paranoia just like tripping out as usual and uh yeah so i fucking cracked on a lot uh and then basically because i went to see a girl i didn't want to be all acidy or like acid like maybe a potential um um i didn't want a a sort of uh, I, I, don't, I don't really know how to explain it but it's sort of like a um not a relapse <laughs> can relapse <laughs> what am i chatting about um a I didn't want like a fucking a late come down so to speak so I was like worried about just like going into town meeting this girl and then being like I'm going to fucking hate my life I'm just going to be negative to you all night and you're just going to have to fucking deal with it uh, I was really scared about that so I literally after I met my dad had some food like I watched some sort of something on Netflix and uh, I just I nip, basically I nipped to the kitchen and uh, I saw a bottle of brandy and I just fucking like necked, well, not necked, careful, I'm not that brutal. I fucking rinsed this fucking bottle of brandy. Golden Keys brandy. <coughs> Oops, sorry. <laughs> Golden Keys brandy. Like, I was just like, <coughs> uh, uh, and I was just like, that was fucking, was awful. And then I decided, but basically, because I wanted the alcohol to kick in pretty fast, I was going to see her in like 20 minutes. I then got on my bike and literally bombed. I fucking bombed to fucking town. I got to the town. I got to town in like 15, 20 minutes, and it usually takes me like 40 minutes to get there. I fucking got into town and I was just like, I'm so fucking ready for you. <laughs> she, she like saw me. She was like, Yo, what the fuck? Are you, are, you, are, you, are you so uh, are you, are you good, yeah? And I'm like, yeah, fuck you. And I'm fucking brilliant, mate. Fucking brilliant. Um, we actually had a really good night. Um, I definitely. Uh, definitely settled a few bonds between us it was really lovely I had a great night so overall I can I can tell you now with my experience that I could trip in the morning uh, I could then eat uh, seven hours later quite easily I could eat during as well um, I was quite productive even after the trip so I didn't feel guilty or anything like that um, and then of course obviously I went out late that evening and drank Three, two, three, four pints of alcohol. Oh no, I lie. I had a couple of sh I had a couple of cocktails, and then I had a couple of pints as well, and I felt pretty good actually. And uh, yeah, no, it ended. Uh, the end evening ended was just a pleasant evening. No, I didn't bang her because she had a boyfriend, but I still smacked her ass. <laughs> I didn't do that either. Oh my god, that guy's gonna fucking kill me one day. I swear to God. Um. Yeah, but that's about it. Anything else on L one P L S D? Buy your L S D. Get it literally in the next couple of weeks. Just don't fuck about because the vendors are going to start shutting down early. I know some are going to be open till God knows when. They're going to be like, okay, one P L S D, one P L S D, one P L S D. You fucking need that one P L S D. If you don't get that one P L S D, mate, I'm gonna fucking. I'm just gonna come round your house and basically I'm gonna fucking feed your cat LSD. I don't give a fuck about the RSPC and they can fucking do one. Oh, um, it's deep in pig shit. So I have like some little, like, let's have a little outro going. Do you, do you, you're not having an outro. It's like everyone's always like, oh, like, look, there's like fucking music going on in the background. Oh, music in the background, eh? Little outro. Little cheeky outro. No, I'm sure this little fucking cheeky motherfucking outro. Mm. Yeah. This is the best outro song ever.